before we start, please remember to like and subscribe to this channel. Jakob Ingebrigtsen is a name that has been making headlines in the world of athletics for a few years now. The Norwegian middle distance and distance runner has established himself as one of the most promising athletes of his generation. The Olympic record holder of 1500 meters with a time of 3 minutes 28.32 seconds, he's one of the best runners in the world. But Jakob's story did not start at the top. It began in the small town of Sandnes, Norway, where he was born on September the 19th, 2000. Jakob was the youngest of three brothers, all of whom showed an interest in running from a young age. Their parents, Geert and Tone Inge Britsen, were both former athletes, so it was only natural that their children would follow in their footsteps. The Inge Britsen brothers have had a great success on the international stage, winning numerous medals at European and World Championships, as well as setting national and European records in their respective events. Henrik, the eldest brother, is a former European champion in the 1500 meters, while Philip has won multiple medals in the same event at major championships. Jakob, the youngest of the three brothers, is considered one of the best middle distance runners in the world, holding the World U20 record in the 1500 meters and the European record in the 5000 meters. Team Inge Britsen is known for their intense training regimen and their focus on developing mental toughness and a strong work ethic. Their success has inspired a new generation of Norwegian runners, and they continue to be a dominant force in the world of middle distance and long distance running. From an early age, Jakob showed a passion for sports. He was a talented football player, but it was his love for running that ultimately won out. At the age of 10, he joined his local athletics club, Sadnes Idritslag, and began training under the watchful eye of his father, Geert. Geert Ingebrigtsen is a former middle distance runner himself, having represented Norway at the 1988 Summer Olympics in Seoul. He is also a coach, and it was under his tutelage that Jakob and his brothers began to make their mark on the athletics world. As a young athlete, Jakob showed a remarkable level of determination and dedication. He trained hard, often putting in long hours on the track and in the gym. He was also a student of the sport, studying the techniques and strategies of other successful runners and incorporating them into his own training regimen. Just a reminder to not forget to like and subscribe for more related content, and check out our top 10 Norwegian athletes to see where Jakob is ranked. Jakob's hard work paid off when he won the first national championships at the age of 13. From there, he continued to improve, setting new personal bests and breaking records along the way. In 2016, Jakob made his international debut with the European Athletics Championship in Amsterdam. He was just 15 years old at the time, but he showed no signs of being intimidated by the competition. He made it to the semi-finals of the 1500 meters, finishing in ninth place overall. Over the next few years, Jakob continued to make a name for himself on the international stage. In 2018, he won two gold medals at the European Championships in Berlin, becoming the youngest ever male athlete to win a European title in the 1500 meters. He also set a new national record in the 5000 meters, finishing in fourth place. The following year, Jakob competed at the World Championships in Doha. He made it to the final of the 5000 meters, finishing in fifth place, and then went on to win a bronze medal in the 1500 meters. By 2022, Jakobsen also set a new personal best time of 3 minutes 28.32 seconds in the 1500 meters, cementing his status as one of the best middle distance runners in the world and the Olympic record holder, as well as winning the 1500 and 5000 meters at the European Championships. How did this success influence Inge Britsen's earnings and business possibilities? Jakob's success on the track has not gone unnoticed by the business world. He has several sponsorship deals with companies such as Nike, Telenor and Gienzidiga, which have helped to fund his training and travel expenses. But his 2023 earnings are set to be $3 million related to the already agreed events. And that is just the earning for attending the event. Bonuses and winnings will be added on top of this. That is a huge amount for this young athlete. Nike signed Jakob already at the age of 17, stretching to 2024, but it is unknown the total amount of earnings. Rumors say the deal is worth $75,000 per attendance on events like Diamond League in Monaco, USA and Germany, while the victory bonus is at $30,000. In addition to his athletic pursuits, Jakob is also interested in business. He's already begun to establish himself as an entrepreneur, launching his own clothing line and started vlogging part-time with average views of 50,000. Member of Team Inge Britsen, Jakob is by far the biggest icon with the recognizable tattoos all over his body. 
This may give the young athlete some benefits in form of recognition on the field and in form of attention. His fiance, Elizabeth Assesson, is also becoming more and more famous in Norway. And once they got married, they will become an elite couple in Norway, both in the athletic world and in the business world. Let's hope the promising athlete has a good run over the next few years, and we look forward to seeing his journey throughout the games, on and off the field. Where do you see Jakob in 5 or 10 years? Who should we do next? Feel free to check out our top 10 Norwegian athletes to see where Jakob is ranked for the best athlete in Norway, or some of our other athletes on our channel. Please share, leave a like, comment, and don't forget to subscribe for more related content. This being it for today, see you in the next one.